The Biscuit Express has been a hot spot for breakfast lovers for nearly three decades, and this week their new owners took over the business with plans to keep the legacy going. News 19's Alexa Harley got the chance to spend some time with both the new and former owners. She joins us now in the studio with more. Alexa. Well, Lindsay, you know that saying, sometimes you want to go where everybody knows your name. Well, the Biscuit Express is that place for a lot of people. Mike and Judy Donovan started the one-stop shop for biscuits in 1997. And almost 26 years later, they've not only fed the mouths of many in North Alabama, but created a lasting legacy. It may be quiet now, but come 4.30 a.m., it will be packed with car after car craving their made-from-scratch biscuits. Welcome to the Biscuit Express. How can I help you? Mike Donovan had a dream. After working for a fast food chain for years, he wanted to open a place people could get breakfast in the drive through I found this place and met with the people, and we leased it and with the help of family and friends working for free. And a lot of people that I knew giving us equipment and things, they really helped us go. And the first day we opened, we only done $90. And we only had $2,000 for a night. And any time we needed something, even a lot of our customers were willing to. And we've hired a lot of our customers in 26 years <laughs> that became employees, real good employees that are still employees. But after 26 years buttering biscuits and crisping bacon, Mike and Judy made the difficult decision to step back. One of the reasons we're kind of getting out of the business, I got sick in October, and then she came up with cancer in November. So it kind of made us think, you know, I'm sorry, but you know, it's time. And then we met John and Brandy, and they were very interested in the business. John and Brandy Anderson have been running the business for about a week, and they plan to not only continue the legacy the Donovan started, but add their own unique flair as well. We're not changing the biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> but one of the things that we really wanted to bring to the community is specialty sodas. And to walk into something where there's a staple, the people, everybody knows everybody, we couldn't destroy that. Instead, they're talking about possibly expanding and adding more biscuit expresses in the Tennessee Valley. <laughs> It'd be my dream come true to see that happen. And right now there are two locations, one on Moores Mill Road and another in Meridianville.